What's up everybody? Welcome back to another tutorial. Today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make your ultimate backup respond in your custom EUP. So for our EUP, we're going to be using Los Santos Police Department and Blaine County Sheriff's Office made by Grand Theft PD. Those are the ones I installed in my previous tutorials, but now today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make them spawn with your backup units. So when you call in for backup, they will spawn in your selective uniform that you chose for them. Now we're not, you don't need to do it through OpenIV. You will be doing it through your GTA 5 main, main directory, then your plugins, LSPDFR, and ultimate backup. So one thing that I, the program I use to edit my XMLs and pretty much any other files I need to edit, I always do it through Notepad++. I will link that in the description below. Good buddy of mine, PC Games guy, told me about it, showed me about it, and I've been using it ever since. And actually these backup coding files you will be downloading are made by PC Games guy. And if you guys haven't checked him out, I would highly suggest to go check his up, check out his channel. He does make some awesome ass content. I love it. I watch every episode. So what we're going to do is we're going to open up with Notepad. And then you'll have it here. I already added my lines into the game. I haven't finished them. So I will show you the process of doing it. Uh, the one thing you will have to remember is when you're playing around with your backup lines is you always have to make sure the chance equals 100. So for me, I got four LSPD UP packs that will respond with the backup I call in in LSPD. So I got four of them there and each chance is 25. So it equals up to 100. So what we're going to do, we're going to head over to Modification Universe. Uh, you will need to make an account to download these files. But if you download the UP from my previous tutorials, then you would already have an account. So the first thing you want to do is we're going to download Ultimate Backup Coding for UP Blaine County Sheriff's Office Uniform Pack 3.1. Already downloaded them. And then we're also going to be downloading Ultimate Backup Coding for EUP LSPD Uniform Pack 2.0. So once they're finished downloading, first thing we're going to do, we're going to open the LSPD. Double click that. So we're going to get to the male one first because the male ones are the first ones. And then as you work your way down, you'll get to the females. And then you'll get to your Blaine County Sheriff's Office. I don't touch any of the North Yankton's because I don't patrol in North Yankton really. So you want to do is double click that. So this will look a little confusing the most. It's pretty simple, but just take your time when you're doing it. Make sure everything's correct before saving anything. And like I said before, your ped chance do have to equal up to 100. So example, if you're doing two peds, you'll do ped chance 50, ped chance 50. So that way it equals up to 50. So what we're going to do is, one thing I always do is, uh, I'm going to change, I'm going to change one of them. So we're going to do class A patches and morning band. So what I usually do is highlight from prop all the way and scroll down. So you get a little line right there. So you want to copy. And then you want to go to your default regions. And then we're going to go right here. Highlight the entire line. Till the end. It's a pretty long line, so. Yeah, so right to the end of PED. So what you want to do is paste. Then you'll have a line here. Because how you copied it, all you have to do is hit delete. And that's it. So it's going to show you what hat it's going to spawn with. Text on the hat. If it's going to spawn with any glasses, ear props, watches, beard, shirt, etc. So you that's all you have to do is just highlight one of them. Oh, wrong one. So we're going to do class B. So highlight that. Copy. 
call that down. And we'll do it for this one right here. We'll do the second one. We'll highlight the entire line. Come on. And then we'll paste over that one. And just like that, you'll have this line again. Backspace. Scroll all the way back. And that's it. So if you look so as you scroll down, you'll see um peds with a rain outfit will be chosen when the weather is rainy, a chance is grouped separately. So you can just tell rain outfit true, because if it's raining you want the ped to come in you know, a rain outfit. Uh, right here's chance is 50-50. So I'm going to leave it. That's how it came. Standard. So what you want to do is head over to your file and look for the raincoat or the raincoat hood. Now since there is two of them, I just copied the raincoat and then the second one below it is raincoat with the hood. So we'll just copy that. Head back over there. Highlight prior the prop hats. Scroll all the way. We get to the end. It's a pretty long word, so it might take some time. And then just paste over. Just like that. Then you'll have this little line again. Backspace. You're good to go. And then like I said, for the hood one, same thing, highlight, copy. And me, I just pasted right underneath it. Right here. So you highlight this whole line, then you paste. All right, so if you scroll down a bit, you're going to get to your Bling County backup. So same thing. My, I got only two EUPs that are going to run at the moment. So the chance is 50-50. So what you're going to do is open not your LSPD, but you are going to open your Bling County Sheriff's one. Double click your mail. And then it's totally up to you which one you want to choose. So what I'm going to do is High vis polo shorts. So I'm gonna copy that. And then we're just gonna paste it right here. That's all you wanna do is just highlight whatever lines in there. And you just wanna paste it over. And then you can choose whatever you want. Like I said, if you do two chances, they gotta be fifty each. Um, if you do 4, 25, 25, 25, 25. Uh, if you want to do 3, you could do 50, 25, 25. As long as it equals up to 100, that's, that's all that matters. So we'll scroll down a little bit lower. Now eventually I will be putting a state patrol EUP in. I'll probably end up putting in um, Echo Wolf. State Patrol. So we're going to want to scroll down a little bit uh, further. So now we're at our SWAT. So you know what we're going to do? We're going to change our SWAT. So we're in Los Santos. Go down to SWAT. So we're going to highlight this whole line. Copy. And then we're going to go right here. Ped. Like this. Paste it. So right there. Now when you call in SWAT, they should come in the designed EUP for the backup that you're just putting in. So and we're going to go down to Los Santos County. Now we're going to grab the Bling County Sheriff line. Scroll all the way down. Get the SWAT. Highlight that line. Copy. That. Yeah, I don't know why my things keep closing, so we're gonna get to there. I like that. We'll paste that one. That's it. And then I know Blaine County is right down here. I'll do this one too, since it is Blaine County one. And yeah, I leave my North Yankton alone. I never go there anyway, so. Uh, Los Santos, let's get a Los Santos one. Do that one, copy. Paste it over this one. Delete. Los Santos County, jump back up our no, Blaine County one. Copy. 
there. Copy over this one, paste. Oh, my mistake. Luckily we have something paste. <laughs> Don't delete it. Don't do what I just did by accident. And then we'll do our Blaine County one. Paste. So now we'll scroll down. Local error. Yeah, we're not going to do any of the error. And now we're on the female. See, now we're at female local patrol. So now you can close these two because they're male. So you want to open up your LSPD. Now you want to double click the female one. And it's up to you whichever uniform you want to copy. It's the same process. Copy. And then just prop, uh, just paste it over here. Paste it over the first line. Then, as you can see, I got 25, 25, 25, 25. So it is pretty much the same setup as doing the LSPD. Same down for Blaine County. You grab the Blaine County female um, coding, and then you just paste it in. So, uh, I don't have any of the state patrol. Like I said, I'll probably end up doing another tutorial on how to put in Echo Wolves. I've had them. I've had them run before, and Echo Wolves and Blaine, uh, Grand Theft PDs they don't overlap each other, so you'll pretty much get a whole UP setup. With nothing overlapping. Then you got your park ranger. And now with now you're into the canine unit. So the canine unit is the same thing. So close that. And then you open your LSPD. And mail. And then you just scroll down until you find the canine unit. Right here. Canine short sleeve or your canine long sleeve. It's so up to you whichever one you want. But by default there is two EUPs there. So you can put both of them in and just run them both at 50. So I'm going to put the long sleeve for the bottom. Copy that one. Canine okay, Patrol. So I got a top one with the short sleeve. So I'm going to do the bottom one. I'll paste that one there. Delete that one. Uh, one thing you do if like what I just did is put it right beside it. You just got to put the space in front of it. Now we we'll change this to 50. Change this one to 50. So now if I call in the canine unit, they're either going to respond in either the short sleeve or the long sleeve. And then, yeah, it's pretty much the same for Los Santos County. And then you got your Blaine County. Uh, Blaine County, let me actually grab uh, long sleeve canine. Because I have the short sleeve. I just seen I didn't have both of them put in, so we're just gonna replace this, paste it, change the chance, and just like that. So then you got your canine state patrol. We don't run state at the moment. Keep scrolling down. I'm gonna get to your ambulances. I don't have any UPs for any of that. corner nothing for that so that's pretty much all of it so just to recap is take whatever code you want highlight the entire line copy it and then you highlight whatever line you're replacing for the UP delete paste I'll say this again always make sure you're head chance equals up to a hundred. You can run all the uniforms I would say, but you would have to make sure the chance is at a hundred. It equals to a hundred. But me personally I like rocking up to two to four different EUP setups. Cause it's nice to get a like variety of backup showing up. So I'm just gonna Save this, but you always gotta save it. Also, I do recommend having a backup prior to editing any of your files. That way, if you do mess up, you could put your old one back in. So we'll exit out of this. I saved it.
exit, close all this, close that, close this, close the internet, and I'll catch you guys in a minute. I'm going to start up the game and uh, see you in there. Alright, now the time to test it with the Blaine County Sheriff's Office. So we're just going to pull a Yui. Pull this guy over. And then we'll call him for backup. See if they will spawn in the right uniforms. Like I said, if you do everything correctly, then you should. Mine did. I'll call him for backup. Up needed on a uh, Great Ocean Highway. I'm right here, dispatch. I'll check it out. See what they respond. Responding. Go ahead. That yeah, worked for him. I'm still in my LSP. That doesn't matter. That guy worked. Let's try Hello. K9. Backup required on um Great Ocean Highway. Oh what? I will see it's you. Okay, I guess we gotta chase him. So at least the backup works. It's a twist of events. I'll show you back up. Oh, that deer almost called. I think the deer just got smoked. There you go. Wanna do it again? You wanna go for it? Oh. <laughs> Showed up in the right EUP, but has a different vest on it. Hold on, K9 unit. See if the K9 works. The dog will probably have a sheriff vest on it because I haven't changed that. So just for testing to see if it's actually gonna work. But I have to change that. Oh, here comes the train. So it is a female officer, and she did did arrive with the right canine unit. So that's good. So that means that works. So I'm just going to dismiss all these. 